is already designated to come to Mangeti National Park. And that will mean creating jobs, adding to the 15 people who are currently taking care of for Mangeti National Park. And it will also open up some other tourist facilities. Swapo's presidential candidate said the party's manifesto aims to take Namibians out of poverty. She also touched on the education sector, in particular focusing on the teachers. We are going to prioritize education comprehensively. We even went further that we have to ensure that teacher benefits are improved including transport and accommodation allowance. And at this, we are doing sure so that our learners receive the same quality of education wherever they are. Nandi Daitwa also told supporters that the party will improve on social grounds for children, the elderly and veterans. She also took time out to highlight services the Swapo Party-led government brought to Kavanko West, saying service delivery is a priority. Regarding the ongoing road upgrades, Nandi Daitwa told supporters that government is in the process of completing various road projects. We are making all these commitments to create jobs for our youth, to invest in sports. Oh, I'm very happy to hear that uh, a consultant for the Independent Stadium finally is awarded. And I'm very happy because sports is very close to my heart. The Swapo Secretary General also had an opportunity to welcome back members who had previously left the party.